Uh, okay uh, jana tulitoa maswali ya physics maswali manne na leo aya ndio masaisho yake uh, naomba tuendelee na nakukumbusha maswali haya yalikuwa na uhusiano na, na mada inayoitwa density sasa ni density lakini katika mixture density okay so problem number 1 ilikuwa inasema a crown is made of alloys of a gold and a silver of a volume of 60 cm and mass of 1.0 kg 1.05 kg find the mass of the gold contained in a crown and the density of the gold is known as to be 19.3 g cm cube while that the silver is 10.5 g cube hivyo ndivyo swali hivyo kwa linasema sasa hebu tuende tuka, tukaone solution yake. Kumbuka tumepewa volume of alloy ambayo tumeamua kuita ni VA, mass of alloy ambayo ni MA na density of gold ambayo ni density of G. And density of silver tumeamua kuita density of S. Na value zake ni hizo hapo kama unavyoziona. Okay. Uh, required. Required ni nini sasa hitaji la swali. Swali nasema tutafute mass of gold contained in a crown. Kwamba crown ni ya kitu kilichotengenezwa na metal mbili au zaidi na hapa tumeona imetengenezwa na silver na gold. Okay. Na crown hiyo ni kofia, ni kofia kama za kifarumi. Okay now. Uh, kar- second uh, second uh, method first method tumeweza kuona pale kwamba ni nini? Ni data given lakini now katika second step tunasema calculation to get the mass of gold. Tunaenda kufanya calculation ambayo itatupa hiyo mass ya gold. Okay, recall the volume of alloy and the mass of alloy. Uh, VA tumesema ni volume of alloy ile alloy ambayo ilitengeneza ile clown na hii alloy ni mchanganyiko wa gold and silver tumesema ili tuweze kupata toto uh, volume yake ni sasa kusema nichukue volume of gold plus volume of silver vile vile tukaambiwa kwamba uh, toto volume of alloy ilikuwa ni 60 na volume of gold hatujapewa na volume of silver hatujapewa also Okay, vile vile tukasema kwamba tuna mass, tukitaka tupate mass of alloy lazima tuchukue mass of gold plus mass of uh, silver. Lakini tulikuwa tumeshapewa kule mass of alloy ambayo ni 1.05 kg. Ni sasa kusema ni mass of gold plus mass of nini? Uh, silver. So now we need to change. Lazima tuichange hii kilogramu iende katika grams ambayo tukaichange 1.5 1.05 kg is equal to say 150 gram. 1 uh, 1050 gram. Zen tukishamaliza kuichange hapo tunarudi pale juu pale ambapo inasema uh, mass of alloy sasa na kusema ni mass of gold plus mass of silver ambayo tunayo sasa hivi ambayo ni 1050 gram sasa na kusema ni mass of gold plus mass of silver but tunajua mass of silver sasa na kusema ni uchukue density of silver uzidishe na mass of gold in sasa kusema ni uchukue density of gold uzidishe na volume of gold. Kwa hiyo now tunategemea kwamba mass of gold ni sasa kusema ni density ambayo ni 19.3 uzidishe na volume ya nini ya gold ambayo utakuja kupata ni 19.3 vg. Okay, hii tutaita kipengele A. Tutaenda vile vile kipengele B. Kipengele B kinasemaje lazima tuitafute mass ya silver. Mchakato ni ule ule kama tulivyoweza kufanya Uh, kwenye gold ambayo unasema ni density of silver times volume of silver ambayo itakuja kuwa mass of silver itakuwa kwa 10.5 uh, uh, volume of silver. Okay, tutaweka pending hiyo. Then itasema then it becomes. Kumbuka tunarudi tena pale pale. Uh, mass of alloy lazima sasa kusema tuchukue mass ya silver tujumuisha mass of gold na sasa hivi mass ya gold pale ninayo na mass ya silver ninayo ambayo ni 10.5 huku ni 19.3 kuona substitute hapa nikisubstitute hapa then nitapata ni equation number 1 okay nitapata equation number 1 no itakuwa ni equation number 2 kwa sababu equation number 1 uh, ni hii hapa tulioipata uh, steam uh, volume volume of alloy sasa kusema ni ngapi Uh, ni volume of uh, gold plus volume of uh, silver. Kwa hiyo nao nitakuwa na equation mbili tayari ambazo ni hizi. Nikisolve simultaneous hapa, uh, nadhani unaelewa jinsi ya kusolve simultaneous. Kwa hiyo ndio maana sikufanya. Mwisho wa siku utakuja kupata kwamba volume of gold utakuja kupata ni 47.73 na vile vile volume ya silver utakuja kupata ni 12.27 cm cube. Okay, lengo ni nini sasa? Lengo anatuambia tutafute mass of gold ambayo itakuja kuwa mass of gold sasa kusema ni density of gold uh, times volume of gold 
Uh, density of God ni 19.3 tunazidisha na volume of God ambayo tumeipata baada ya kusolve simultaneous ambayo ni 47.73 tukishazidisha hapo sasa uh, tutakuja kupata kitu kama hicho hapa hichi tutakuja kupata mass of God ni sasa kusema ni 921 grams kwa mass of God is 921 grams in the crown kwa ukumba uzito wa God katika ile crown ulikuwa ni 921 okay tunaenda Okay. Ah uh, tunaendelea swali la pili tunasema uh, weni 100 cm cube of acid and density 1.8 g a mixed with a mixed with 180 cm cube of water wait wait acha acha a photo of the density 10 g cm cube the density of the resultant mixture is 1.5 g and what and what contraction has occurred sasa anapotuambia contraction hapa anamaanisha ni decrease in volume of acid kwa sababu tunajua tukichukua acid tuka neutralize na Okay, tuone tukaone solution kama ilivyo ada. Anasema a uh, volume of acid tumepewa ambao tumeamua kuita ni VA na density of a mixture tumeamua kuita density M na vile vile volume of water tumeamua kuita ni VW na density of acid tumeamua kuita ni density A na density of water tumeamua kuita ni density W na volume zake tunazo hapo tunaziona. Okay, tunaendelea. Tunasema liquid ni nini sasa? anataka resultant contraction ambayo tukimaanisha kwamba ni decrease in volume for nini acid kwa sababu tunajua reaction itakayofanyika hapo acid itapungua okay tunasema sasa second step tunasema second step tunaenda calculate to get the contraction ambayo tunasema mass of uh, alloy mass of uh, mass of nani ea tumesema ni acid mass of acid ni sasa kusema ni volume of acid times density of acid ambayo uh, volume of acid ni moja na density of acid ni 1.8 ya pa gram centimeter cube. Kwa hiyo maana yake hapa ukizidisha hapa utakuja kupata mass of acid ni sasa na 180 gram. Vile vile mass of acid ni sasa kusema ni 1 gram. Okay? Tunaenda kuona sasa mass of water. Mass of water sasa kusema uh, ni volume of water times density of water ambao unasema mass of water sasa kusema hii hapo 180 cm cube mara 1.0 g cm cube of water. Ukizidisha hapa utakuja kupata mass of water sasa na 180 g. Lakini swali natuliza tunaendelea kusema mass of water sasa kusema 180 cm g. Tumepata. Hatua ya tatu sasa tunaenda kutafuta toto Tunaenda kutafuta tunaenda kutafuta uh, Atua ya tatu sasa tukasema tunaenda kutafuta toto toto nini toto mass of nani uh, toto mass of ya moji na pamoja na nani toto mass of ya maji na nani uh, na acid Okay uh, toto mass ni sasa kuchukua nichukue toto ya mass toto mass uh, ya hiyo mixture ni sasa kuchukua hiyo mass of water ni jumlisha na mass of nini mass of acid ambayo sasa utakuja kupata jumla yake ni 360 kwa sababu mass of water nayo na mass of acid nayo. Kwa hiyo nikijumlisha hapo tuto naipata. Vile vile sasa onso uh, uh, total volume of two liquid naenda kutafuta jumla ya vimiminika viwili, volume ujazo wa vimiminika hivyo viwili ambao naambiwa total volume sasa kusema ni volume of A plus volume of W ambao W manake ni water na volume VA sasa na volume of acid tunazo zote na substitute hapo nikijumlisha napata toto uh, volume sasa na 280 sasa naenda sasa kutafuta hiyo contraction yenyewe ambayo ni hatua ya ngapi ni hatua ya 4 naambiwa kwamba density of mixture ni sasa na kusema total mass over volume of nini volume of mixture ambao naambiwa kwamba ili niweze ili niweze kufanya je kupata volume of mixture 
lazima nichukue uh, total mass ya hizo mixture ya hizo liquid mbili nigawanye na hiyo density of nini e mixture au ya hizo uh, liquid mbili nikigawanya hapa nitakuja kupata kitu kama hichi hapa hichi Ah nitakuja kupata nitakuja kupata ni 360 g ukigawanya kwa 1.5 g ambayo ni ya mixture nitakuja kupata ni 240 cm cube. Sasa construction yake ni ipi? Ili niweze kujua kwamba hii acid imepungua kwa kiasi gani? Imepungua kwa kiasi gani kwa sababu tunajua acid react na maji, acid inapungua. Mengi anakuwa ni maji. Kwa unachukua nachukua nini total volume? Nachukua total volume natoa na ile volume ya mixture toto volume kabla sijachanganywa na kuja natoa na ile baada ya kuchanganywa. Kwa hiyo nikitoa hapo nakuja napata nikichukua hiyo toto volume na hii after this 280 before mixture and this one is mixed already mixture. Kwa maana yake nikitoa na kuja kupata 40 cm na nini? Kwa hiyo the volume decreased in acid is 40 cm cube. Swali la tatu liko linasema Uh, a light alloy consists of 70% of aluminium and 30% of magnesium by mass. What would you expect its density to be? Density of aluminium is here apo and density of magnesium is here apo. Okay, kwa kumbe swali sasa tunataka tutafute density of a mixture. Okay, that's what's up. Mixture manake ni vitu vili ambavu mekombaini pamoja. Okay. Density, uh, density of aluminium tunayo hii hapo tumeita density hey density of magnesium hii hapo tumeita density m aluminium percentage hii hapo na magnesium percentage hii hapo hizi zote zipo ndani ya alloy kwamba katika alloy mule ndani kimo, kila kimoja kime contain kila kimoja kime contain percentage yake okay required density of alloy ambayo tunasema required in density of alloy manake mixture of two uh, metals akao kasema Atoe ya pili tunaenda sasa kutafuta jinsi gani tunaweza tukaipata hiyo density of nini alloy density of alloy sasa kusema mm, ni total total mass of uh, of two metals over total over total volume of nini of two metals okay tunaenda kuangalia hapa tena tunasema kwamba total mass tunaenda kuitafuta total mass sasa kwa sababu hatuna na total volume kwa sababu hatuna maana yake total mass sasa kusema ni mass nichukue mass ya 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 nini nichukue masi ya hizi tu meto ambazo uh, ya kwanza ni aluminium na nyingine ni nini uh, ni magnesium. Kwa hiyo maana nikizijumlisha hapa ndio nitakuja kupata toto masi lakini sina mass of magnesium wala sina mass of nini aluminium. But nakumbuka mass of aluminium sasa nichukue asilimia ile iliyoko ndani ya alloy nigawanye chini ya mia nizidishe na ile toto masi ya nani ya alloy. Sawa ambayo itakuja kwa ni 7 over android times total mass of uh, alloy. Okay, ukizidisha hapo utakuja kupata kitu kama hicho hapo hicho. Utakuja kupata uh, utakuja kupata ni 70 mt over ya moja vile vile kwenye magnesium utakuja kupata kitu hicho hicho ni 30 over times mada total uh, mass of alloy ambayo utakuja kupata ni 30 mt. Msina mt uh, chini ya ngapi ya 100. So now mt itakuja kuwa hivi kwa hiyo total uh, total Toto nini sasa hapa? Tunakuja kuangalia toto toto mass of nini? Alloy itakuja kuwa ni toto mass of aluminium plus toto mass of magnesium ambayo ndio tunaiona hapo sabini chini ya moja kudumisha 30 chini ya hapa. Also vile vile uh, tunatafuta toto volume. Kama tumeweza kutafuta toto mass ya alloy basi tukatafute toto uh, volume of alloy kwa sababu density of alloy ni sasa kuchukua toto mass of alloy over to, over divide by volume of nini? Alloy total volume of alloy. Kwa hiyo total volume of alloy nayo sasa na vile vile nichukue volume of aluminium jumlisha volume of nini? Magnesium ambayo itakuja kuwa kama unavyoona hapo 0.7 mt. Ambapo sina sasa hizi value lazima nianze kuja kuzitafuta kwanza. Nikatafuta volume of aluminium nikaipata hii hapa. Vile vile nikaja kwenye kutafuta uh, volume of magnesium nikaja nikaipata hii hapo 0.3 mt chini ya 1740. So then Toto volume nachukua hii volume of aluminium na jumuisha na volume of magnesium then inakuja napata kitu kama hicho unachokiona hapo chini sasa basi vile vile tukasema vile vile tukasema kwamba uh, tukasema kwamba uh, remember density of alloy sasa kusema ni total mass over total volume ambayo ndio hapo total mass tunayo ni hapo juu na total volume tunayo hapa chini 
Hapa tukafanya utafanya na wewe pia kwa sababu siwezi kugusa na mkono na uwezo kamiona kwa hiyo that's why na kuonyesha kwa picha this is the normal calculations utafanya hapo utafanya we utagawanya utagawanya utasubstitute kwa sababu hapa hiki cha juu tunachoona 70 mt over android plus 13 mt over android over kubwa 0.7 mt hapa hii ni sasa kusema ni mass over nini volume kwa hiyo utakwenda utafanya utafanya utakwenda mpaka mwisho wa siku utafanya utafanya utakwenda utakwenda mpaka hapa utakuja kupata jibu hili hapa pale kwamba ili jibu sasa ndio tunalisema kwamba a dense of a law is sana kusema 2316 twende swali la 4 swali la 4 linasema uh, a law of a copper and tin as a volume of e hapa na hii the dense of a copper as e hapa e hapo and tin is e hapa how much how much the volume of each metal must be used if the density of this of alloy is as a tin za azetini. Okay. Sasa bas. Hapa napo tuna vitu viwili tayari. Tuna tini na kopa. Hii ni alloy au ni mixture of two metals. Maana yake anahitaji to, to determine volume ya tini na gold. Haya, okay? Tunaendelea kama kawaida. Uh, volume yetu ya alloy tunayo hii hapo, density of copper tunayo hii hapo, density of tini tunayo hii hapo, na density of alloy alloy density of alloy tunayo. Sawa? Volume of alloy tunayo density of copper tunayo na density of tin tunayo okay required ni nini volume of copper and nini a tin okay uh, volume nilisahau kuandika hapo na volume of uh, tin inahitajika pia sa so, volume of alloy volume of alloy sasa kusema va ambayo ni jumla ya alloy ya tin na nani na gold kwa sababu vt ni volume of tin vg ni volume of gold vile vile mass of alloy sasa kusema MA ambayo ni sasa kusema MT plus MG. Okay, tunaendelea kusema magnesium sasa mass of gold ni sasa kusema ni nichukue density of gold in addition na volume volume of gold ambayo itakuja kuwa ni ngapi ni 8.9 VG kwa sababu volume of gold sina kwa hiyo itaendelea kubaki VG pa. Na MT vile vile nitafanya hivyo hivyo kwamba itakuja kuwa ni uh, ni density of tin times volume of tin ambayo itakuja kuwa ni 7.3 times uh, volt of tin kwa sababu hiyo 7.3 ni density of tin nikizidisha nitakuja kupata hivyo okay also vile vile uh, volume uh, of alloy sasa kusema ni volume of gold plus volume of tin kwa volume of alloy ni nayo ni moja ni sasa kusema ni volume of uh, a gold plus volume of nini Itin, tukuja kupata kitu kama hicho. Sasa hebu twende tukaangalie. Twende tukaangalie tunapataje. So now here tunayo mass of a gold, mass of alloy sasa na mass of a gold plus uh, mass of a tin. Ambayo lakini tunajua kabisa mass of a tin sasa kusema kitu cha hapo. Uh, density of uh, density of, mass of alloy sasa but tunajua mass of alloy sasa kusema ni density of alloy plus volume of alloy mass of alloy tunayo mass of alloy tunayo tunachukua density of alloy tunazidisha na volume of alloy ambayo itakuja kuwa ni 7.2 hii hapo okay ukiendelea zaidi utakuja kupata mass of alloy sasa na hii hapo vile vile tunasema then becomes mass of uh, mass of alloy tumeipata ni 762 gram kwa tunarudi pale kwenye question yetu 